It was on June 24, 1949, that a new era began in American television with the airing of Episode 1 of Hop Along Cassidy. With action and suspense out of the Old West comes the most famous hero of them all, Hop Along Cassidy, starring William Boyd. As the hero who always wore black, he was part cowboy, part detective, a storyteller, and always a good guy. In 49, movie actor William Boyd was down on his luck. He had played Cassidy in 66 hour-long movies, but by the late 40s, few remembered his name. And to make matters worse, an L.A. newspaper printed his photo with a story about a man convicted of a crime with the same name. Then, when all seemed lost, Boyd's wife suggested he borrow the money and buy up all of his old movies, which he did for a third of a million dollars. Then he had the hour-long movies cut up into pieces, put on new opens and closes, and created more than 180 half-hour-long Hopalong Cassidy TV shows. It's Hopalong Cassidy! <laughs> He then licensed merchandise, watches, trash cans, cups, dishes, trading cards. And at the same time, he and longtime sidekick California, played by Andy Clyde, took the show to radio for four seasons. Here's a scene in which California gives Hoppy the lowdown on a town they've just entered. I've been checking around. And I know something that maybe you ought to know. Yeah? This is a mad dog's town, and you've got no business sashaying across the street like that. I got a job to do. When the TV show, made from recycled clips of old movies, hit the airwaves, it was an initial success. Hopalong Cassidy became the biggest Western in early television and was a hit on radio, too. I'm Dennis Daly.